Hey guys, it's Alex and welcome back to Alex Sports. Hope you guys are having a good day. But before we start the video, I want to let you guys know in the comments if I should change up the format or the way we make these videos every day. I was thinking that I might want to change it up, make, want to make them different. Just to see if something else uh, is better or if something new changes stuff. Because like, just recently it's like the views aren't as great as they were before but i think i just want to try something different and that might work and if, let me know if you guys want something different and how do you guys want these videos to be made if there's something you want to change to them let me know in the comments below i'm um very i'm up to doing a lot of things differently and seeing if anything works because this is fun to do but if there's a better way to do it or make it better for the channel to grow and anything else, just let me know. Because I really do want this to be successful, but I just need the help of you guys and you guys' support to help it get it this far. And let's just get into the video. Starting off with BPL news, we have Crystal Palace signing Joe Rodwell from Ajax for a fee of $7.9 million. And Everton signed Kuko Martina from Southampton for free. Let me know in the comments if those are two good signings below. And in MLS news, the Houston Dynamo signed Tomas Martinez from Braga as a young DP. It completes their three DPs of Albert Ellis, Kubo Torres, and now him, all under the age of 24. So that's really good, and they have a really good future. And the Union signed United States U18. Anthony Fintan or Fontana as a homegrown. He joins a list of some very good homegrown players. The um, Dynamo, not Dynamo, the Union have been developing with Austin Trusty and Derek Jones. Let me know if you think he's going to be a good uh, signing in the future. And in NBA news, the Lakers win Summer League as Lonzo Ball is named the MVP. After his first game, he struggled. He became dominant and was amazing after that. Averaging around 16 points, 9 assists, and like 6 rebounds. He looked like he was really, um, he was developing into a, a really good player. And if he's anything like this in the NBA, the Lakers should be set for, for the future with Lonzo Ball. In college basketball news, we have Mississippi State landing 5-star um, Reggie Perry. And Indiana land 4 or 3 4-star players at forwards, as in Desmi Anderson. Jerome Hunter and Ray Thompson. A lot of signings in the anime in the last um, day. In NFL news, the Panthers fire um, GM Shettleman. He had a lot of issues with a lot of players, and it seemed like it was a good move by them. But it's just had a really weird, weird timing. And the Steelers and Redskins don't um, sign Le'Veon Bell and Kirk Cousins to long term deals as Adela was today for the franchise tag. In college football news, Ohio State land five-star tight end Jeremy Rooker. In OB news, we have the Nationals beating the Reds 6-1, Orioles beating Rangers 3-1, the Cardinals beating the Mets 6-3, the Blue Jays beating the Red Sox 4-3, the Cubs beating the Braves 4-3, the Marlins beating the Phillies 6-5, Stanton hit two home runs, Twins beat Yankees 4-2, Mariners beat Astros 9-7, and the Indians beat the Gi um, Giants to score 5-3. That's going to be today's video. Hope you guys like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching and peace.